So a lot of people have been kind of debating and discussing what will happen now with streaming with Google. And a lot of people are overstating that it will either go the way of the 3D TV or that it will just take over everything. And I think it's kind of right in both fields where it could very easily go down the drain like the 3D TV where it's big for like three months or so and then it's just completely dead, you know, just a dropped project. But I don't think it will be quite that simple. I, I think Google definitely has enough money to enter the market and as some, some smarter people that actually have thought about the topic a bit more have realized that, you know, what drives these sort of projects would be first party games. And so this is why I think that it won't take over the market at all because both Sony and Nintendo make great first party platforms, which has kept them in for decades, literally decades, and nothing's gonna replace that. It may, however, replace things like the Xbox, which doesn't really have that many first-party games, now that every much the whole library's on PC anyway. It may take over half of the computer crowd, half, it'll probably replace the mobile market, if not just enhance the mobile market, or shift it, rather. And um, it may take over a bit of, uh, like a small portion of the console crowd but i think consoles will still be around still be around and some people are saying that it will the, the business of brick and mortar stores where you buy physical releases and all that and i don't think that's necessarily true which is another thing people were discussing that physical releases will go the way of the 3d tv i guess or like the atari and i don't think it's necessarily going to be like that it may very well take over the mainstream but there's plenty of places much like the arcade machine which everyone would say without actually researching that there is no arcades nowadays but that's not actually true it, the arcade machine has actually gained a lot more value to it now that it's not predominantly around and there's plenty of places that you can go to specifically retro stores that's that are all just built around selling those old classic systems that you can't get anywhere because it, even with games as you know you're not buying the game you're buying a license to play the game and people want to be able to own it physically to, to actually own the game itself there will always be that want and need from people to do that it's not just the older crowd even though that may be the majority and it probably is the more gaming enthusiasts but there's plenty of young people that will become gaming enthusiasts and gaming enthusiasts is a way of life is is you know hobbyism there's plenty of people that will come into this world being quite young that will grow to actually want that sort of thing out of their games too it's not that insane or crazy to think about and there's going to always be those small niche stores that will have them and stock them it probably won't be so much for triple a games i don't see the worth in it or definitely not indie games because you know they won't have enough money to produce the cartridges but i think they'll always still be around regardless even if the main major store chain like eb games or gamestop or whatever you have in your country those those game stores may go out or they may just become entirely fucking pop culture um, accessory stores instead. We will still have places to get physical copies of games. I am curious to see where things go with this, but I think initially it's not going to be anything too impressive and it will just kind of develop over the years, you know, like just about any console does when it's starting out. I do, I am most interested in this though because no one's been able to enter the console market for over like 10 15 years it's always just been sony microsoft and nintendo as the the three major companies producing consoles even though it's not really a console it's a streaming platform but console wars will almost be a gone thing it will be more like service wars <laughs> service wars like netflix and hulu